man, dry brush, dry brush, dry brush some more, then dry brush, maybe wash a little bit, and then dry brush, dry brush, dry brush. Yeah. Lots of dry brushing. See the difference between sunlight and no sunlight. Sunlight makes it look a little blue. No sunlight, a little too dark. But yeah, I tried to dry brush it to see kind of the column look. The uh, skulls still going to have the same damn mold line that they had, even though I tried green stuff. But you can see it's rough boulder, I guess you'd call that a peck, where they peck at it to change the shape of it. And the front's smooth. So we'll pretend that I don't give a poop, and I'm going to maybe throw some vines over it. So far, just brown and gray. Well, black primer. Got the build up from black, dark gray, light gray, white, generic uh, fish aquarium terrain, as I like to call it. Doing this quick because I don't feel like spending a gazillion years on it. Got to finish this. It's just it's painted for now, even though I presume it would be painted on the floor or inlaid, whatever. Um, have to make it look more like it's painted stone. So there's what that's up to. Had to put a little green stuff on the bottom of the columns to make them flush, even though I really did it as best a job as I could to get the magnets in the center. They are your smaller magnets. I probably should put a piece of metal in between them to really secure it. But it it's a little it'll hold up. I mean I can pick it up and sling it around, but if you give it a full blown tip, it's going to come off. This one's a little better. See how they match up to the damage in the stonework, so you don't really have a hard time figuring out where they go. Look what I got myself for my birthday! Woo! Do re me, you better watch out, cause I got a titan too! The king of proxy will lose his throne! Oh yeah, sorry. I'm not good at smack talk. Okay. I painted the chaos symbol. Um, I'll probably still add a little more white to that because it's dried a little darker than I expected. And next is just flocking. Okay, so you can see I have blue and stuff on it to make it look a little more, uh, I guess, overgrown? Uh, yeah, this is really just to make it match my mat on the table. I'd like to have done it in a deader look. I don't know if that's proper English there, deader. Uh, let's see if she'll zoom in. Bet you guys didn't know, but this structure was built by goblins. Yeah, in fact, it was built by only two of them. Tell you what, man, you put them boys under some stress, they can accomplish some stuff, man. Cheap pay, too. Man, this place rocks. Uh, put it on the green mat so we can see roughly what it looked like. I'm sure this thing's going to show up in some future videos. Um, I wouldn't call it 100% done. I could do a lot more weathering and earthwork or whatever, but terrain more so than single minis you really have to tell yourself when to stop and say you know what it's done enough for now move on to the next thing so yeah there's what it looks like um overall it's you know pleasant kit aside from those skull seams and uh yeah